Hi guys, Joe Rooney here from FRT Gold once again. Thanks for checking out another Betting Explained video where we're just aiming to give you a short, brief explanation, keep it nice and simple, of um, some things that you might come across in the world of horse racing and just betting in general where, that you don't quite understand. Just a few little things that, um, yeah, that you might come across that perhaps you might think, actually, what does that mean? Or, or you're not quite sure. And I think instead of, you know, having to read four or five hundred words, it's easy to whack it into YouTube. And hopefully this channel can um, really provide plenty of info for you that you need. So today, what I'm going to talk to you about is um, what happens if there's a dead heat. Now, of course, these things don't happen in horse racing all that often, but it's something that can happen every single day, really. Um, you know, it, it, it can happen in any race, whether it's a three mile uh, race over hurdles or whether it be a you know a five furlong sprint of course the latter a bit more likely you would say but a dead heat is is for those of you who don't know I'm sure many of you know this is that um it's when two horses cross the line at exactly the same time there's no way that you can tell which one has finished first or second sometimes there's more than two but that's really unlikely but um even a photo finish can't separate these and what you might think then is that ah oh, you know your bet's not a winner you've had you know, there's a dead heat, there's no winners, bookies are laughing. Well, that's not actually the case. What happens in a dead heat is that um, you picked, you have still picked the winner, but you've just picked a winner along with another horse. So, of course, you can't have your full stakes, um, you know, given back to you. So let's say you had a, a £10 bet at 5 to 1. Of course, if your horse were to just win that one, your £10 for, for 5 to 1, that turns into £50, and you get your £10 stake back, £60, if your horse wins outright. Now, in a dead heat, what happens is that your stake is halved. So um, the odds stay completely the same, but your stake is halved. So that £10 bet you had on a 5 to 1 then becomes a £5 bet at 5 to 1, meaning that you have £25 winnings and you get your £5 stake back, which means it's £30 back in your betting account. So, you know, although it's a little bit frustrating because you very nearly picked a really good 5 to 1 winner, you do still get that, um, you know, some good value and you still get that winning feeling, which is the main thing in horse racing betting, of course. What's really important to remember is that it's never the odds that are halved. If the odds were halved, you might think that it's no different, but um, actually if the odds were halved, you'd have your £10 on a horse at 5 to 2, halving those odds. I mean, you'd have £25 winnings and £10 back, and £35 would be your total going back into your betting account. That's not what it is. It's always your stake that is halved. It's half the stake. So, um... You are still technically a winner, but not quite as good as it could have been. But that's exactly what happens in a dead heat. So, um, you know, don't think that you get all of your winnings and don't go out and celebrate before you have checked exactly what the winnings are. But, um, yeah, that's what happens in a dead heat in horse racing. Please do check uh, the rest of the channel for any more Betting Explains videos that you would like. Thank you.